facial I got a hydrofacial who's gonna do the microdermabrasion um but she suggested going for the hydrofacial instead I'll just take my glasses off and my skin girl <laughs> I mean I've got no fake tan on now um so I'm looking a little bit pale but that glow is real the glow is real my guys no makeup on I highly recommend going and getting a hydrofacial because this, I mean, I'm just trying to get the light in in my car, but this is great. I stay like this all day now. No makeup, no fake tan. And just enjoy the glow. Five hours later. So time has passed since then. Um, still looking very glowy. And we made the sticky firecracker sauce. Uh, for the tofu. It's delicious. I followed Parita's recipe which I'll put in the link below and it literally took me like five ten minutes and it's amazing. Okay so we're having a bit of a, a cozy night in and look at these. So I made some nachos with the applewood cheese. This is the best cheese for grating, so we did it in layers. So, a little bit of nachos, <laughs> a little bit of cheese. Uh, we're gonna pop it in the microwave and it's gonna be yummy. <laughs> We are on a new day. I have just filmed this makeup look, the Meredith challenge, where she just puts loads of foundation on and it actually worked out okay. Um, but that's going up on my Instagram soon. I just wanted to say hello and also show you, I've made some more cookies. Um, they're great, honestly, like me and Kurt just cannot stop eating them. I think I should go over here. So I wanted to let you know that I made some more cookies and I wanted to show you because they turned out great. And I tried to make a heart one, so I'm gonna show you how that turned out as well. Um, for the rest of the day, I'm not too sure what we're going to do, but I do know that later on tonight, we are going to watch Wakanda Forever film because we weren't able to go and watch it at the cinema and it was showing. So we're gonna do that tonight, I think. Um, also, I've chipped a nail. Um, I don't, I don't mean to give you the finger, um, I can kind of see that. I've also put a plaster um, over the burn that I did just so it doesn't freak anybody out because it's still kind of like healing and obviously with baking didn't want to, you know, any, any nasties in there. So I can't wait to show you the heart cookie. These are some yummy cookies that we have at the minute, yum yum. And then the heart cookie is in there. Oh, I hope it turns out okay. 
So yeah, if you're ever in Aldi and they have some of the plant cookie mix left, definitely get some because these are just warm from the oven. So. They're just the best and all you need is butter and water. We use the Flora butter, this. This is my favorite butter. Um, I'm sad there's not like a low pack alternative yet because that butter is incredible. But there isn't, but this is my go-to butter for everything for toast, cookies. So recommend the Flora one. Guys, look, she turned out perfect. Ah, I love her. I love her. I filmed that we went to Ikea and we've brought a plant together. Look at our plant. We don't have a name for her or anything yet, but she's here. And then also Kurt's growing some chili plants because apparently they're the easiest to grow. So I'll show you those in a sec. These are all his chili plants. Um, obviously there's a little one there growing, a little one there, and then there's this little guy here. He's going and then we've also repotted one as well so he's in his own little in his little pot and we'll see how he's doing when we went to ikea as well i bought these um these lights for the bathroom so i'll just show you the bathroom we put this mirrored cupboard in ourselves because there wasn't any mirrors in the bathroom and then we just got these lights here so if you just hold it and it looks amazing now we got two but the other one is faulty. The nearest Ikea for us is like an hour away. So it's a bit of a silly trip just to return one six pound light. Um, so we definitely need to order another one, but this one looks really nice. And it's nice to do makeup in the in the bathroom now if it's, if it's raining like it is today. So the weather's pretty, pretty minion today. I recently did a reel with all my favorite like fragrances on it. Now again, I don't have a sense of smell. So what I did was I tested them all out. So I wore like different perfumes and the ones that I got compliments on. I kept, so this one is the Ariana Grande, God is a Woman. Now, if you'd have watched my first vlog, you'll have known that Kurt actually got me this for Christmas and it smells incredible. Every time I wear it, it's like, oh my God, what is that? So I highly recommend getting this perfume and I don't think it's that expensive either. So it's cruelty free and vegan. Something else that I actually wanted to talk to you guys about is this. If you've not seen it, um, where have you been? This is the five minute journal and I feel like it just makes your morning better. If you're in a bit of a rough patch at the moment, just taking five minutes, well not even five minutes, like two minutes in the morning and, and two minutes in the evening to fill this out. It really makes so much of a difference. So we've got the date at the top that you just write it on and then there's normally just like a little quote or something that'll help you maybe get through the day or give you a little bit of inspiration and then you've got to write three things that you're grateful for three things that would make today great so a lot of the time what do i normally put so spending time with somebody working out spending time with friends putting myself first for the day don't overthink go to hot yoga you know little reminders to do that and then a daily affirmation as well so you can just put something simple you know, write out a full sentence and then in the evening you write out three things that happened that day that were amazing and how could you have made the day better and then if you follow this daily how to make the day better onto the next day and then you can kind of like do that prove yourself one percent every day if you do that by following this it really help so yeah that's my little tip of the day is to get yourself one of these although i got mine just before lockdown and because i haven't been doing it every day it's lasted me like two years um and they weren't that expensive back then but i think they're, they've gone up now to like 30 40 quid which it is a little bit pricey but it lasts you ages and it really keeps you in check so i definitely recommend one of them something that i wanted to ask you all is to find out if you prefer kind of like vlogs or if you want to see some kind of like makeup that's the washing machine if you want to see some kind of like makeup tutorials or my favorite like makeup tips or if it's more food that you want to see going forward or just a mix of both but let me know in the comments